Hi everybody, welcome to Carry On Jeff and John once again, absolutely awesome of you. Bit slow uh, getting in, I don't know if people are getting the notifications, but I thought I was only going to be uh, showing this awesome uh, Nacho Shearer to about a couple of people, but the YouTube family, so loyal, they're all coming in now, absolutely fantastic. Wendy, uh, I hope you feel a lot better sweetheart, I know you haven't been too good, but um I have visited, yeah, make sure you're okay. So, Wendy, I'm glad to see you, darling. Beach Live 78, thanks, bud. Um, great guy. Can't say enough words against you, about you. Absolutely brilliant. Lives in uh, Cornwall. What a fantastic area that is. Uh, he does his walks and um, some of the events he goes to. Uh, Shows you videos on Florida and, and places like that. Absolutely awesome guy, he really is. So, Beach Live 78, thanks for coming. Absolutely awesome. Suka, thanks for coming, sweetheart. Best mod on, on YouTube, he's absolutely fantastic. Uh, Scrapping Irish, uh, another one of Raphael's friends. Friend of Raphael's, you're a friend of, you're a friend of uh, our YouTube family, uh, my friend. Absolutely brilliant. Scrapping with Irish. That man's got all the gold. Hey, only joking. Now he's a great guy. Nana, uh, thanks for coming, sweetheart. Uh, Denise is in. Raphael, thanks for coming, my friend. Absolutely awesome of you. Uh, Tony Lambert, thanks for coming, my friend. Another YouTube family member. Everybody grab up Tony. Uh, a great guy. He's become quite regular now. So, open arms. Let's have him. Let's have him in our YouTube family. Right, there's nine people in, five likes. Uh, I don't think I missed any. Freddie Farrington, thanks for coming, my friend. Hello from Grimsby, everyone. Absolutely brilliant. Freddie, I hope you're okay, mate. Give my love to uh, uh, Mandy and the family. Brilliant people, they really are. Great guitarist. You've yet checked Freddie Farrington out. And I've just noticed that when I go round to our YouTube family, you see one, of, one or two of our YouTube family there. And it, it, it makes me feel so proud. I think to myself, you know what? They're there. They're actually doing what we're asking to do, like, you know, to support each other. Because without supporting each other, it's a waste of time. Anyway, less than the waffle. I don't want to think you want to be listening to me all night. Nacho, Nacho, man. I want to be a Nacho, man. Absolutely brilliant. Ross, thanks for coming, my friend. Right, ten people in, seven likes. Less of the waffle and let's get cooking. That's the catchphrase from now, anyway. Less of the waffle and let's get cooking. Right, my friends. What we need here uh, is a bit of uh, parsley. And on this plate, what I've got, this is this is just a guideline. This is a great shearer. If, you, if the, the family's all around the table, this is what I did for the lads the other night on Friday. A few beers. Play dominoes, cards or whatever. Uh, do this nacho shearing platter and just help yourself. I was going to do the uh, garlic bread tonight, but uh, I'm going to save that for another time. That's another awesome uh, way to get together than that. Anyway, I've got ham chicken, uh, red onions, capsicums. I've got an uh, orange one. You can use whatever colour you want. You can use sky blue ginger if you want. I've got a bit of red left over here. Some mushrooms, some mozzarella cheese there, some nachos. There's your nachos, my friends. I think we all know what nachos look like. Um, paprika. I've got a bit of a hot paprika in there, um, and we want some pizza topper. Now this is uh, tomato and herb. 
you'll get that in any shop, cost you about a pound. But what it costs you to do your uh, pizza topping uh, sauce with, and what it takes, it's a hell of a lot cheaper. We could do it from scratch, but that's another uh, video. How to do pizza top, uh, you know, your topping for it. So there you go. Anyway, that's all the ingredients. I'll just move this out of the way. I'll leave that there, you don't eat it. Get yourself a tray. I've got myself a glass one. The oven on 180, I've got that on at the moment. Get yourself some foil. Like so. Tuck that in there like that. This is what I find, this is the hardest part, doing this bloody thing in here, like that. Right, that should fall in there, my friend. Right, what we need to do now is put your nachos in the bottom there, like that. And what we want to do uh, is just spread it out. You'll know how many nachos you want when you've finished uh, laying them out. And what we want to do, basically, is just cover the bottom. And try and get the big ones. Because obviously in packets and that, the way the shopkeepers and that boot them around and that and they all get crushed and then it looks like nacho salt, you know what I mean? I've bought a bag of them and I tell you what, I was lucky to get some some uh, poor ones out. Because the rest of them, like you say, they're like nacho salt. Right. You've got them in there like I set this board away. It'll be a bit lower then. Put that on there. Right, you've got a layer of nachos, my friends. And what we need to do is get some mozzarella cheese. You can use whatever cheese you want, but you'll find that mozzarella is the best for when you're doing, uh, especially pizzas anyway. This is more like a pizza, but it's done with nachos. Plenty of cheese on there. I'm gonna use this full bag iron. Right. Dead easy tonight, is it? This is, I'm earning my money tonight, trust me. Right, it's up to yourself, just put your toppings on. There you go. A few mushrooms, slice your mushrooms up nice and thin. So we've got mushrooms on there, uh, a few capsicums, just spread it all out. Bosh, bosh, on there, like that. I just want to thank everybody that's turned up tonight and supported Carry On Jeff and John. You're all absolutely fantastic people. You really are. I want two people say to me, um, in fact, when I go to the local shop, people say, hey, you're that guy that does carry on Jeffrey. And I said, yeah, they said, you must earn a fortune. I said, you're having a laugh. I said, I'm skinned. They said, it looks like you're driving that bloody motor of yours. I said to them, I don't get nothing for it. I get nothing whatsoever. In fact, it costs me money. But... It's the people that I've met over the years. It's, it's, you know, it's just absolutely fantastic. It really is. And that's what it's all about. If you think you're going to make loads of money from YouTube, forget it. Get yourself another part-time job. That's what I say, anyway. Um, bits of chicken. So, basically, whatever you like on your uh, pizzas, uh, if you've got any oddments or anything, just use it up. That's all you've got to do. And put it on, put it on, your, uh, on these nachos. Right, we've got that. Uh, a little bit of uh, red onion. On there. Love red onion. I know I'm not talking to you. I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to do this layer. And then I'm going to say to a few people. Because one or two people have come in now. I agree, Don. Smash on the way in. Thank you, UK Scrappers. Thanks for coming. UK Scrappers. Got a lot of time for that, man. Another one of Raphael's friends. Awesome. Awesome YouTuber. He really is. Uh, about time you finish that uh, shed. Up the turn army, but you're all absolutely fantastic people. You really are. That T Tonya Lambert, I said Tony. I do apologise, Tonya. Make sure you grab her. Absolutely fantastic. And when I say grab them, I mean grab them, but not literally. You know what I mean? Absolutely fantastic. Um, there's one or two. Pandora, thanks for coming in, sweetheart. You finally made it. Um, check out Pandora. Um, she's not been for a while. But obviously, we all get busy in that. I understand all that. 
or Pandora Haunting with Debbie and watch your video, sweetheart. I haven't been getting your notifications and you'll find a lot of us are not getting notifications. We really ain't. Um, it's just ridiculous. We all work hard to get these, uh, to do these things, get them on show, uh, all your editing and all that, and I can't even get it right so you can go and get your notification, which is absolutely appalling. It really is. If you run a business, a proper business, like if we run a business like that, we won't, we won't have a business. You cannot run business like that. You've got to provide. You've got to do it right. Right, my friends. You've got all that right in there. What we need to do now, I've got a spoon, your topper, just a spoonful at a time, just put that on there, bosh, 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 just keep, it's all you got to do, it's dead easy this is, but it's something different. Awesome, absolutely awesome this is going to be. Right, you've got that like that, haven't you? Hey, you've got that there like that. Now what we do, my friends, is you put another layer on. Let's, let's build it. We're going to smash this one. This is going to be absolutely fantastic, I'm telling you. You're going to love this. Just put it in the middle of the table and watch the kids' faces. They'll go, you what? Oh, that's good. Oh, that's nice. And off you go. It's better than just sitting there with a packet of crisps, isn't it? Hey? On oh, there, boss. Put... Get them on there. Now what we do, my friends, we put some more cheese on. I hope you like your cheese. Mind you, if you like pizzas, and that kind of stuff, you're going to like it. And I think this dish, more, the more cheese you put on, the better it is. That's what I say. Uh, get it on there. Voila. And what I'm going to do, my friends, I'm just going to put another few little bits on the top. You know what I mean? I like, I, I just, I just love it. It's, it's art, isn't it, cooking? You know it is. Oh, it's fantastic. Oh, it's kept the more ham on. I love ham, my, my kids. They're not kids, they're the lads. Oh, a bit more, what should we have on now? What should we have on now? Should we have some more uh, mushrooms on? Everybody like mushrooms? Let's get them on there like that. More red onions. A bit more ham. Absolutely awesome. So to put this in here, my friends, I'm going to talk to you. Have a little chat amongst yourselves. I just want to thank the 13 people that's coming. I really do. Right, that's on there. And I'm also, I think, I'm going to put a little bit more cheese on. There we go. That's that. And what I'm going to do, my friends, because my lads like a bit of paprika, is I'm just going to a little sprinkle of paprika. Now, you can put parsley on. That's optional. That's entirely up to yourself. So I just showed you that, but I'm not putting parsley on mine. I'm going to leave the parsley off. I'm not a great lover of it, but you can put parsley on. Give it that piece of taste. So we put that in the oven. which has been on 180 and we want that on there for about 10 to 12 minutes so I'm going to keep an eye on the time 15 minutes 25 minutes 27 minutes away right just going to come and say hello to you I just want to say thank you um, for coming uh, there's a few lives on tonight so we're not really expecting many but if the YouTube family didn't come, I wouldn't be here. And that's how awesome you are. You're all absolutely legends, you really are. Um, I can't understand when you get views that they go up. How come views go down? They've either viewed it or they haven't. But there you go. That's another thing that I can't understand. Unbelievable. Um, there's so much to learn on this YouTube. How to get your 
to get your content out there. But uh, obviously mine's not get mine doesn't get out there. It really doesn't. But I'm gonna I'm gonna have to get someone to to have a look at my channel, see if they can do anything, or give me some advice how to get it out there. You know. What would the temperature be in USA? Um, I haven't got, I really, I don't know what it would be in USA, uh, Tonya. Um, but Nana's cooking might be able to help you. Um, well, two, 220 in the UK is maximum. So it's a notch down for this. So whatever yours is, I think yours is, is yours about 350. So I would say it would be about 280. That's what I think it is. Do you know what I mean? So, but if Nanny's in, Nanny, does anybody in America know what 180 would be in, in America? It wants to be, not uh, Tonya, it doesn't want to be hot. It just wants to be down a, a notch, just over halfway. We don't want to rush this and, and, and burn the cheese, you know what I mean? So, so I would say three quarters of what it is on your uh, cooker. Three I'm sorry I can't help you on that. But, uh, yeah, Nana would know about that. Yeah, you just don't want it too high. 11 people, 11 likes. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, what I was saying, I'm going to try and get some, uh, uh, try and get some, some advice on to how, how, to, how to push things, you know what I mean? Um, my minutes have gone, my minutes have gone up, so I want to thank the people that are helping me. They're starting to, to decline uh, a bit. But as long as I can keep in, in that thing in uh, keep at 24,000 minutes uh, a month, and then we should be okay. But it's like watching an egg timer go down. You think, hey, what's going on? Like, you know what I mean? But um, 356 Fahrenheit. Thanks, Russ. Toy, I hope that helps you. 356, so around 250, I think. Yeah, just touch it. Don't put it on four. Just put it on three, about three quarters. Just that, just between halfway and three quarters, and then you'll be spot on. Because I don't want you to ruin it. I really don't. So, there you go. Twelve people, everyone like, I just want to thank you. Um, what we're doing now, basically, is waffling. 350 degrees is normally what I cook things in. Thanks, Nana. We'll just try and help her. Uh, uh, Tonya, thanks for coming Tonya, you're absolutely fantastic. Carry on, my three-year-old great-nephew loves your recipes. Well, that's absolutely fantastic, it really is. That touches me, that does, it really does. I'm just getting myself, uh, composing myself, because I am a sensitive person, and that, that is one of the nicest, that's, that's absolutely fantastic. Tell him uh, from Karen, Jeff and John that I absolutely adore him. I really do. And I bless him. That's absolutely fantastic. Oh. There you go. A three-year-old kid who likes me recipes. Brilliant. I just can't. I can't get over that. I really can't. That is absolutely fantastic. That, to me, is like winning the lottery. I would feel the same. Absolutely brilliant. I just... Thank you. Brilliant. That is on problems, what I send you, will do great on dishes. Go great on that dish. Thanks. Right. So it is herbs, Raphael. It is herbs. Fantastic. So I'll, I'll, I've got it now. I've got it in the packets. I can start to uh, use it in some of my cooking. Because I, I, I just don't understand. I don't want to put some in. Uh, I did put some, one of the herbs, on some uh, chicken. And that turned out nice. That was like a thyme, thyme flavour. But don't you worry, I won't be wasting that. I've still got some uh, wild mushrooms left. Um, so I'm going to do, be doing uh, a, a recipe for, with that to use them up. But they last, like you say, they last you 12 months. What I'll be doing, I'll either be going, I think I'm going live on Wednesday. Um, and I'm doing bang, bang cauliflower. For the vegetarians, you've got to absolutely love that one. I've got loads of recipes for you. Twelve people that haven't liked. You're all waiting now, aren't you? You're all waiting. We should put some music on, shouldn't we, really?
Have a little chat, let's boogie, let's keep partying. Yeah, it's boogie time. Keep partying, everyone. You can buy dried mushrooms at TK Max. Well, that's the first lady like of I can't believe it. Unbelievable. I love cauliflower. But if you like cauliflower, this is the one for you on Wednesday, sweetheart. My, my wife absolutely loves it. He's dancing, lady. Let's go. Suka. Fantastic. Fantastic lady. Oh, I love this. I just love this song. Oh, it's finished now. What are you hating? We keep moving. Kicking with Karen. Thanks for coming, sweetheart. Absolutely fantastic of you. Brilliant. Everybody, yeah, grab her up. Everybody grab each other. I like to use that. Uh, right under last layer of cheese, you know, just to not burn in the oven. That's a great tip, Ralph L. Thanks, my friend. Honestly. Right. Check out Raph L. He's a great cook as well. He really is. Raph L. Top man. Thanks for doing whatever you're doing for me, honestly, mate. You know, you know how you're helping me. Absolutely brilliant. High kicking. Right, what's the time? 23 minutes past, one minute. Where's my glove? Right, my friends, that, and if that light's in the way for you, but that's how you want it. You don't want to burn your cheese. I put that in for about 10 minutes, and then I'm just going to take my thumbnails, put that in the middle of the table, and it's job done. Want to turn it round, my friend? I've got to tell you thumbnails. I mean, it costs me a fortune to do these, uh, these rows and, and whatever. Right! Ba, 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 ba. Put that in the middle of the table and tuck in. My lads had one the other night and they, abs and they absolutely love it. Voila. Mm. And that, my friends, is a nacho, nacho, nacho sorry, Nacho Sierra. Mm. How easy was that? Mm. Sit round the table. All here, get tucked in. Oh, beautiful. Mmm. Whatever you do, my friend. Make sure you put some paprika on. Do it that tight. Awesome. Mmm. Sorry about the mouthful now. And that show looked delicious. Thank you. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, lovely jump. Raphael, cool. So easy. Is it the kids one? 
So I'm, yeah, I'm making this tomorrow. Do this one tomorrow. Get the kids involved. Get the kids, put them in. Put, hey, our kids, what do we, what shall we put in here? Boss, 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 boss. Job done. They're going to love it. Honestly, it's just something for the kids. Probably this lockdown, I don't care about lockdown or whatever. Put that, a few drinks, whatever, and boss. And people will love it. Put what do you want in, put some uh, smoky bacon in, anything. Oh. Just help yourself. Get plenty of cheese in there, my friends. Where's Tan uh, Tanya's little uh, nephew? The three year old, yeah, son. Oh, brilliant. Made my day, that has. Really has. What the power now? Thanks for coming, darling. Absolutely awesome. I think we've all got what the power now. Amy, love you loads, darling. Please run John and Wendy's playlist. That will allow them to do. Nana, thanks for doing that, sweetheart. Yeah, if anybody can do it for us. I mean, I've been doing it four years, and um, I've been lucky I've got half halfway through my bloody hours. Four years, you know what I mean? It's not about getting any money. I just want one dollar. Once I get one dollar, I've fulfilled it. I've fulfilled my ambition to get a pound off YouTube so I can buy a bloody egg. That's all I want. I don't want anything else. Trust me, I'm not bothered. And that's how my kids laugh. I just want to... That is my, that is my aim. I'm never going to get rich on YouTube. I'm too much of a fiddle. I don't care what I say. Just a rat race. YouTube is one big rat race. The amount of people that come to my challenge and to my ch ch channel and some of the things that they'll comment and all that. And I know very well they've only watched about 30 seconds of it. They're only going to come watch 30 seconds. Don't bother coming. I don't want them. They don't want them people. I really don't. Joe Dean. I'll be making this tomorrow. I make it now, but... I've got no mozzarella left. But I've got a bit left. Joe? I've got a bit left, sweetheart, if you want that. Now, I said sweetheart, is it Joe? Or Joe? Or Josephine, like a girl or whatever. But if you want to come round and have a bit of mozz mozzarella, I mean, you can gladly have that. It's only about two quid a ton anyway. It's all right. But put whatever you want, put whatever you want in. I see everybody keeps sharing the love. I can modify this easy for my sauces. I do modify keto and gluten free diet. Fantastic. It's only just a little idea, that's all. Ah, <laughs> Chucky's here. Chucky's here. Hey, huh? Hey! There we are. Hey, we can have a lap on here, really can. So on Wednesday, uh, we are going to do Bang Bang Cauliflower. You're going to love that one, you'll love it. Suka, thank you, sweetheart. Ah, oh, John, you are so kind. Wendy, you are. You're an absolute darling. I'm glad. I, I, I missed you last week and I thought, oh no, what's happened, what's happened to Wendy? Are you upset or whatever? But no, she wasn't very well. But I'm, I, I'm glad you... you you are better. I don't like any arms come to my friends. Thank you very much. Can't wait for Wednesday. Well, I'm glad you, you feel passionate about it. The thing is, when you're cooking, um, it's very hard to, when you go live, to cook without making any mistakes. If you make mistakes, you look a bloody prat. But, all the top chefs, you see them on the TV and all that, the mistakes that they make in, in cooking and that, is because they've got the best editors in the world. If I had the best editor in the world, I'd go, you know, my, my recipes would, would, would perhaps get more than, I might get 200 views in a week, you know what I mean? But they get millions and millions, and theirs is no different from what anybody else is. But it's because of the name. Because I'm not known. I'm not. Nobody knows me. 
you know what I mean? Just I'm just John, but some people call me uh, Jeff. Why do people keep calling me Jeff? And that proves, because when I go live, I tell people, my YouTube family know my name is John. So they never call me Jeff. So it goes to prove that they've not watched any, hardly any of the, uh, the video. Because they say, well hang on a minute, his name's John. Why am I saying, do you know what I'm trying to say? It's all BS, it really is. But, you know, what can you do? It's good to make mistakes. We learn from them. Yeah, we do make mistakes, we do learn from them, Fred. What I'm meaning is, when I say make mistakes, when you do when you're cooking something. Um I made some a while while back, six, seven months ago, and I made some balls and whatever and that, put them on and they just crumbled. And they shouldn't have done that, you know what I mean? That was because I was rushing with them. They should have got in the in the fridge just to firm up a little bit, you know what I mean? But I didn't, I rushed it. And I was I like to do things to perfection. I've got to get things right. It's no good me showing you a recipe and it, it's bloody wrong and it looks crap. What is the point? You know what I mean? We're all here to try and learn something. I don't know everything, but I'm still learning. After all these years, we all keep learning. The older you are, the, say, the wiser you get. But it's all about learning all the time. Lady Likeable, uh, I know where you're coming from, sweetheart. If, if they're slowly getting rid of their channels that are... A mod, but I can't see that because that's costing them money, isn't it? You know, the more people that get to monetize, you know, it's it's, cost, it's, it's better for them. They want people uh, to get monetized. But there you go. At the end of the day, um, it's entirely up to the cells. You know what I mean? Perhaps, perhaps that's why I lost connection there. Perhaps because I'm I'm doing a little bit of uh, moaning and that. You know what I mean? It's if I get, if I, if I get the 4,000, I get the 4,000 hours. If I don't, I don't. And then, you know what I mean? But I'm not going to, I'm not going to waste my time. I've been on it doing this for four years now. And if, I, I've always said, if you're going to bounce on the, on the spot, what is the point? Hey, uh, there's more, there's more to life than YouTube. The only reason I do this is because I enjoy showing people my recipes. My own, these are my own little take on things. You know what I mean? But uh, life is what it is. Tony cheered me out on Facebook. Thanks, sweetheart. I really, I really do appreciate it. I really do. Um, you know, it's just fantastic of you. Um, should keep us genuine ones on YouTube. I say get rid of fake ones. Wendy, I am so with you. There is so many fake ones out there. It's, it's a, there's, there's a lot of crap out there, there really is. You know what I mean? Ladies slots, I know you're here, sweetheart. I know you just put John I'm here. Ladies slots, uh, thanks for coming, darling. Absolutely awesome of you, it really is. I hope everyone's got to Lady slots. She's, a, she's adorable, she really is. Um, absolutely fantastic. So. Uh, the casinos open yet, Lady Slots. I bet you're uh, itching to go to that casino, aren't you? Check out Lady Slots. I think we've all got each other. I'm going to make a list of my YouTube family, and then when we come next week uh, or on Wednesday, I'll know. I'll know exactly who's here, how many people are here. You know what I mean? It's the same with any uh, family uh, on YouTube. You get your own little clicks. You go on some live streams. They don't even want to know, they don't acknowledge you. If that's the way they want to be, but what they're not thinking is that, you know, you've got to interact with each other. You really have. I've had uh, people still coming to me that when we first started, what, four years ago, I've gone back on some of my old videos and it's the same people all the time. The last two years is absolutely phenomenal. Our YouTube family has always been there for us. And I'll tell you another thing as well. When these channels get mon monetized, you don't see them again, trust me. It's one big rat race, it really is. But I shall tell you something now. If I get, if I do get to uh, watch hours and whatever, and I do get monetized, right? I will, I will, I will pr uh, vouch for you that I will always make sure that my YouTube family is the first comer and they are always the, 
I show the love to them straight away. You can't tell me that every time you leave me a comment that I have never ever got back to you. Because I know I have. I might miss the odd one because I've not had either the notification or... But I spend hours and hours and hours interacting with everybody. Showing them how much I, uh, I appreciate them. I really do. And that's how it's going to be. People come to your lives. Um, but one or two that come to the lives will also come and uh, leave me a comment on, the, on, on the, what we're doing tonight. But I'll always go back to them. I really will. Um, I don't know if cooking channels are popular on YouTube. Anyway, because... I see some some channels and you know there might be I don't know bounce bouncing a football on the floor or I don't know you know something like this you know this they get this you know go like that. they get thousands of views they say look at me playing playing these instruments have you ever seen this before you know what I mean and they'll stand there going like that and then. You look on that channel and they've got like 24 million bloody views and you think, yeah, well, it's crap. It's just fraud. It really is. But the channels, like a lot of our YouTube family, spend a lot of time and a lot of money buying ingredients, doing things that you need to do, buying all your crafting stuff and all that. What for what? Is it... We're the channels that should be, be be rewarded, the genuine ones, the passionate ones. You know what I mean? Unbelievable. It's right there now, isn't it? Get, to, get two things, bang them together, and we'll get loads. Honestly. Now, I just want to say, um, when I finish this live stream, it won't be very long, do you think we can do a raid again? For Nana, can we go on Nana's and, and, help, and help her out? Nana's cooking craft corner. If Sue could put the link on, let's do what we did last week. Let's go and cheer Nana up. Awesome lady. Really would make her day. And I'll tell you something now. You get to know that lady and you'll think to yourself, you know what? Carry on Jeff and Nana's put us back put us in touch with an awesome lady she will support you up to the hilt she'll give you that much love that you'll think you're married to her honestly she's absolutely phenomenal and when you go to her live the only thing you've got to watch out for is when she starts singing but now laugh out loud honestly she's a great singer as well so please show some love to her and suka thanks for putting that link up you are absolutely fantastic. And I just want to say a massive thanks to uh, Russell, the mod, and Suka for the job that they do on uh, on this channel. Absolutely fantastic. We really are. I love it to loads. Um, I'm sorry I can't pay you, but I can pay you in showing you out some of these recipes and that, you know what I mean? But if I ever met you down the street or whatever, in a pub or whatever, that, I would gladly buy you a drink. I really would. And I really appreciate what you do for me. Honestly, you're absolutely awesome. Right. Been on 40 minutes now. Um, I'm going to put this on the table. And let the uh, let the monsters come. Mm. Beautiful. Kids are lovely, isn't it? Look at that with a bit of sauce on there. Beautiful. Mmm. But whatever you do, my friends, stay 10 minutes, don't burn it. Mmm. So basically, it's just until the cheese gets, because everything else is cooked. It's just a matter of getting the, uh, the mozzarella. So I would suggest the best cheese to use, if you're going to use cheddar, Put that on the bottom layer, but always put your mozzarella on the top. That's a good tip for you. Love mozzarella. You know what I made today?
I've done the Sunday dinner and got some mashed potato left over. So I'm, I'm still there and I'm thinking, what can I do with that? So what I did, put it in bowls, flatten it down like a pancake, and I put smoky bacon, part cooked from smoky bacon, not to, not till it's crispy, just, you know, I don't know, 30 seconds either side. I put strips of bacon in it, cheese, rolled up into a ball, and then I did my batter. I did paprika, breadcrumbs, dip it in an egg, sorry, flour, uh, egg, egg, back to flour, back to egg, and do that and make sure that you... That's what I always do. Flour, egg, flour, egg. Do it twice and all your, all your uh, breadcrumbs and all that will stop on because when you put it in the breadcrumbs. That's the way to do it. Egg, flour, egg, flour. And then back to egg and then into um, the breadcrumbs. Paprika breadcrumbs. And I deep fried them for about six minutes. Took it to brown off. Put it in. Absolutely awesome. Just cut it open. Bacon and cheese in here with a mashed potato. Awesome. Me and the wife had one too. That's nice. Don't you have to do that on the channel. Could do. I can even be fire over there. Anyway, are we going to... Uh... It was honestly when it really nice. Outdoor and adventure and travel, thanks for coming, uh, another awesome lady, um, I really do enjoy the walks that you do, um, I don't know if you live near them, well, you must live near them, well, you're always in them, you ought to have been uh, Ansel and Gretel, Gretel. That's, uh, they used to live in the woods, but she's always in the woods, absolutely fantastic lady, ladies lots, I used to always click I used to do to always click and subscribe. That's another thing. Subscriber buttons are all off. I've been going to most of my YouTube family. Go on there. Off. And then when you go and watch the video, it's on. And then when you commented, smash the like button, look back, it's off. You put it on before you get in, put it off before you get You know what I mean? It's, it's just ridiculous. I don't know what's happening. Lady, yeah, uh, likeable. Don't worry, sweetheart. Just just keep uh, plodding on, sweetheart. You'll be all right. Never let things get let, get you down. Really ain't worth it. Right. Nana, I'm your friend now. We're all friends. Just going to say, I just want to say thanks again to Outdoor Adventure. I don't really praise, it, praise her up very much, do I? But she's a lovely lady. I do appreciate you coming. She's our YouTube family. She really is. Lovely lady. Outdoor adventure. Walla. Love it a bit, sweetheart. Right. Uh, Raphael, you still here, my friend? Freddie Florentin? We are family. We definitely are family. I thought, why to? Had a shake-up. The only shake YouTube had there, uh, Wendy, is a bloody milkshake. So don't you worry about that, sweetheart. Bloody shake up. Yeah, milkshake. At the end of the day, if they, if they are going to get rid of some channels, get rid of them. You know what I mean? But if you do, they do. Whatever. The only thing I do is miss all my YouTube family. But half the time I can keep in touch with you. Keep in touch with one or two of you. You know what I mean? Which I already am now. You know, on Twitter or Facebook or whatever. If I want to be nosy, I can always go on Facebook, Twitter, and that's see what all my friends are doing. You know what I mean? But um, life is is what it is. It really is. Anyway, shall we do a, a, a raid to Nana's? I think that's fair, isn't it? Let's go and show her some love. Right. I just want to say, <clears throat> um, I should get seven hours for doing this. Seven hours, bloody no. You know, you get left for bloody murder, don't you? Seven hours. Wow, thanks ever so much. Hey. Right. Um, I just want to say um, you're all absolute legends. I just want to say thank you. I hope to see you Wednesday when we were doing Bang Bang Cauliflower. 
I hope to see you there. Now please go over to Nana and let's go and show her some love. She's absolutely awesome. UK Scrappers, Raphael, Wendy, Outdoor, um, who else? Lady Dislots, uh, Tonya. Um, you're all absolutely awesome. I'm just having a look. Do I haven't I missed? Have I missed any really outdoor ladies like Wendy? Uh, Russell, awesome guy. Nana, we're all, Nana, go. go. Go get your life sorted out, sweetheart. Hopefully people will come and come to your life. So we're doing a Nana raid. Right, from carry on, Jeff and John. You're all absolutely awesome. I'll see you Wednesday. I'll put the notification out and hopefully you get it. If you don't get it, um, I'll have to start doing it by letters. You're all absolutely awesome. Nana, here we come. Thank you. Awesome.